Good morning. Looks like I'm going to be by myself this morning. Lucy's not feeling well. Y'all remember to think about her and your thoughts and prayers. And also, I didn't hear from little Jane. She was going to try to come on, but bless her heart. Y'all, she needs you lots and lots of prayers for her to get well from her fractures and her little accident that happened. Y'all, uh, we do cherish your prayers here. We believe in prayers and we thank you and we love you for them. And I guess without any further ado, me and Bubba will get started. He jumped up here about the time he heard me start saying good morning. So talking about going online. Anyway, so good morning, Bobo. Tell everybody good morning. We got anything else to say before I put you down, Bobo? Thanks, Heather, for being here. I see you in here. I'm going to wait for somebody else to come before I really get started selling. Okay. As we know, we're going into, well, today is the first day of July. So we're going into the Christmas in July sales. Y'all be sure to visit all the channels. I'm sure someone will have a link in connecting them all. I have decided I'm going to show a few Christmas items throughout the month. And then I may have one day where I just do Christmas. I'll have to get with Lucy and see what she thinks. She'll know more about telling me how to do that. But I am going to incorporate them throughout the month because I have a lot of Christmas I'm willing to share with y'all. <laughs> I have some vintage Christmas. I actually have a lot of vintage Christmas. I have some newer Christmas. I have cookie cutters. I have the lights, the candelabra lights that everybody loves. I love. I actually have several of these in the box. While we're waiting, I'll just show this off, I guess. But I do have several of these in the box. They have their original Murphy t uh, tag. And I worked at Murphy Mart as a teenager. That was our local, like, Walmart. So I, I know that these are very popular throughout the holidays, and I'm going to have several throughout the month. Good morning, Sarah. Good morning, Denise. Good morning, Heather. Good morning, everyone. I'm just on here talking, telling that I'm going to do Christmas throughout the month. Got incorporated with my other vintage hard goods and clothes and things. Good morning, Patty Pauls. Good morning. <clears throat> Y'all have just me to put up with today unless someone decides to come in. Um, hello, Dolores. Good morning. I'm just getting started and telling about some of the things that I'll have. I just started showing off that I have several boxes of these. And... Um, I will have to start these off on an auction at at least $8. I can't go any lower than that. That's probably about what I gave for them or more, probably more. But I would like to start them off. But throughout the month, I'll have several boxes. That's kind of where I started this morning while we was waiting on everybody. And does anybody have anything they need to say? Any, any prayer requests or thoughts or any updates? or? anything good morning i'm so happy to see you oh jane you will be in in a little while but oh and here's christy yay christy thank you thank you for joining me christy Let's see how to put you up here like yeah okay thank you thank you and jane only only if you're able baby you had me Brian the other day looking at you feeling so bad. Good morning, Belinda. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. Patty Pauls, Jane, Melinda, Dolores, everybody. And I hadn't said hello to you. Good morning. And I don't mean to miss you. Jane, you move slow because you should, darling. I want you to take care of yourself. Belinda, I'm so worried about Jane too. I wish I was closer. I just want to reach out and help her somehow, be closer to her. Do something. Jane, you need to let us tell us what we can do for you, darling. We love you so much. You're part of our family and we're just hurting with you. Well, it says I have a couple of people here, so I guess I'll move on. I guess I will move on with these. We'll start off with Christmas in July with the first thing being Christmas. Um, these are in the box, vintage. 
they I have tried them and they do work in the past. I will try them again. Actually, I have an electric cord right here. I can try them right now. And they do have the older plugs, but they're more, you know, safer, newer than, uh, like they're not 50s. They're more 70s, 80s. I could look on, uh, and uh, there it's like, <laughs> oh, it's missing one candle, one bulb. I have to see if I have another bulb. It's just a little night light bulbs. I don't know if you can see, but they're all the ones, they're burning. Oh, it's got to blind me. Let me unplug this. They work. <laughs> I'm going to start these off with an $8 bid. I know it's early for Christmas, but Christmas in July is one of my favorite times. But it, it does have the little uh, paper in it, you know, in the bottom still. You know, a lot of times you get them in there pretty. Oh, you know what? I think I hear the bulb rolling around in here. I do. Let's see. That does it work? Back up here. This is giving me something to start off with fun, huh? It works. It had just come out. So if anybody's interested in these or later on, if someone's watching, you just email me. My email is right here in the corner. One of these corners, I can't never tell on StreamYard. But anyway, one of those corners, this is my email. If you ever see anything that, you know, it's, oh, I know why it's unscrewed so it can fit in the box. Duh. That makes sense. That looks that would look really pretty in a window or something, you know, at night. Yes. Really nice. Yes, indeed. You could use it year round if you wanted to. Good morning, Aunt Marion. Good morning. Good morning. I hope you're doing well. I'm looking forward to seeing you soon. Well, we're you know, I've told y'all we're planning a sixtieth wedding anniversary for my parents. We're so blessed. Aunt Marion lives in Illinois and she's gonna come help us. We couldn't do it without her, and we know it. <laughs> okay. That was a Christmas item. Let me show this little Tupperware shaker. Now, I know that it used to have a little thing in here that made it shake. That's not in it. So I'm going to let this Tupperware container, which you could still use. You could even put baby formula. You could put anything you wanted to in it. It has the measuring cups. I'm going to do it for $3. I need to get me a little sticker. I'll try to get me some stickers on this stuff soon. Good morning, Denise. So only three dollars for the little Tupperware. Just because and I did it that, that cheap. That would also be Go good ahead. if you didn't want to use a bowl. If you wanted to use that for like your omelet or something. Just mix it and right. in it. Mix it all together. Great idea, Christy. Good idea. Yes, and shake it up, huh? Yeah. Thank you. Thank you for helping me out. I need all the help I can get. Okay. I have this green vintage bowl. Now, that could be Christmas or any time of the year. You'd have your green and red for the Christmas or you can have green, like I said, springtime, anytime. I'm going to do it for $5. I'm trying to get some room so I can get some more stuff in here. So if you want the vintage bowl, glass bowl for five dollars, it could be yours today. <laughs> and it looks like Sarah wants the Tupperware shaker. Okay, Sarah, it's yours. Good, thank you. Sarah, you need to come and visit me and take about half of the stuff home with you. <laughs> I got you down. I have to write it right away, y'all, because I'll never remember. Okay, and so I have these little uh, cooking, let me see, dishwasher safe, microwave safe, freezer oven safe, up to 350 degrees, like to make little cakes in, little uh, like breads or cakes. or Low pan, that is perfect. Small low pan, Thank you. right? Sometimes I can't think, Christy, and I think you. these are miniature. Most of the time I can't think. It should be. They're... They would probably make about a five inch loaf because this is about six and a half across, but the inside's probably about five. Uh, they're going to be three dollars each, and I have three of them. I have a let it snow, I have a red deer, they'd be pretty just stacked up, and I have a Santa Claus. If you just want one or if you want all three, 
I tell you what, if you want all three, you can have them for $8. If you want just one, there'll be three each. And again, that tells you about, you know, their oven safe and stuff. Let me let you look at them good. I like this. So you can make zucchini bread and stuff like that. Little mini loaves. Exactly. Loads exactly. I love that the little rain dish too. That would be perfect to give as gifts because some people do give like banana bread and stuff like that. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. And if you gave them this little dish, they would have a very nice present. But if you could just make them and, you know, take them out and wrap them, like you said, too. Okay. So that's my little loaf pans. Okay. Then I have um, this 1970s avocado green glass. We drank out of so many of these with a the little thumbprint. Or button print. Some people call it button print. Glass. I'm going to do it for $3. And it is. <clears throat> it would even be pretty just with some stones or something in it for decor. But. Or if you. Oh, it's about six and a half inches tall. You know. Or if you drink your drink. Your special drinks at uh, Christmas time. I always drink eggnog. And it, it, it does have the steam here, like the depression glass or the pressed, pressed glass. Yeah, and it's if you fancy. like to, you could use that for like New Year's or something. If you want a little bit extra wine in that glass. There, there you go. You go cause it'll hold a lot. Back in the, I know in the 70s, uh, the dirt's free, y'all. Um, back in there, we, we drank a lot of Pepsi back then. I don't drink Pepsi so much now. I drink Diet Coke, but. And all these glasses was just always filled with our Pepsi Cola back in the day. Good morning, D. Good morning. Good morning. Little Lucy ain't feeling too good today, so y'all just got me. We'll have to be patient with me today. Let me rattle a while with y'all. Jane may come in, although I don't know. I'm kind of conflicted about that because I feel so bad for. If you don't know, um, D. Jane has fractures. Three places in her back, I understand. She can tell y'all more when she comes on here. Let her tell her story about it. Okay, next I have this little uh, tray with the little legs on it. That's Christmas uh, snowman. And it would be so good for a cheese ball or, you know, a, a crackers, anything. If you're doing your little table for the holidays. And I'm going to ask five for it. It's a pretty little special bowl. Um, it's a Garden Ridge Snowman. That's about all I can see on it. Made in China, but it, the little legs and all has the little pads on it, not to scuff up your table. This is a little Christmas tray with feet with snowmen. Snowmen are my absolute favorite. I love uh, everything but the holidays, but I love snowmen. One time I had so many snowmen, it was ridiculous how many snowmen I had. <laughs> and if you still um, have cookies laid out for Santa, that would be the perfect. Right. Great idea. Great idea. Um, and if you're eating all the Christmas cookies and you need to study later on after Christmas about some low fat living, <laughs> you can have this book for $1. <laughs> it's a hardback book. It just says low fat living. Turn off the fat makers. I need to read this, but I'm not going to. It has lots and lots of little recipes and exercises and tells you about your digestive system. Shows you some exercises to do. I'd rather talk about the cookies and the loaf. But if you would like this book, it's a dollar. <laughs> That's for after Christmas, you know. That's for after Christmas or right before, maybe lose a few pounds so you can eat at Christmas, maybe. <laughs> Keep that, from, keep that book from me. Oh, goodness, that's funny. I have this little blue hobnail little tiny pitcher. Let's see, where is my... Oh, I'm still suffering with the sinuses, so forgive me while I look around and try to find stuff. Can't hardly see. Oh, it's almost four inches tall, and I'll do it for $5. It does have this little sticker in here. I don't know the brand, the, the name of it. It's not, 
the, the sticker says A A N A W. It looks like A. It's it's kind of missing a part, so I don't know. It is very pretty. You could put toothpicks in it. Okay. Thank you. All right. Then I have this little Christmas star and Christmas tree. You can have both of these pieces for $3. Be pretty to put some little candies in or something. Are you little some stones or something in for the holidays? A tree and a star. Both pieces together for three dollars. Christian, you'll have I know you will, but you'll have to tell me if anybody wants anything because you know I can't do more than one thing at a time. I'm incapable. Okay. Dolores. <clears throat> Dolores wants the tree and the star. Oh great. Thank you, Dolores. Let me write you down for that. Let me get my book over here so I can hand write things down. Now it's Dolores. Three dollars. Tree and a star. Thank you so much. I had this little miniature um salt and pepper shaker set, and I'll and it's gonna be three dollars. It's gonna be my magic number today. Oh, I have three on it. They do have the stoppers. I believe that they are vintage. I'm going to see if I can get this up here where y'all can see. All the people that do this and just make it look so natural and easy, like D, I envy y'all. Maybe one day. Maybe, maybe, maybe not, but maybe. It does have a little sticker. I don't know that. I, oh. It says in China, so maybe they're not, maybe they're just made to look vintage. Okay, $3 for those. And let's see next. Oh, I have this pretty cup. Oh, okay, Bobo. You know, it says hand painted Gibson, and it has a snowman on it. It's a pretty large size cup. We'll do $3 on it. Sue is here. Good morning, Sue. You snuck in. I didn't see you. Sorry. I apologize for anybody I didn't speak to. It's not on purpose. That would be perfect to put candy in for somebody. Right. Again, a gift giving thing. Right. Gift giving. And I was going to mention that today. I have a lot of Christmas mugs. If anybody's interested in like buying them to send for gifts. One time we had a church event. And we went out and gathered up all the Christmas mugs we could so that we could gift like our seniors. I believe it may have been a senior party, if I remember right. And we ended up with a lot of extras left over. So if you're interested in any, you know, Christmas mugs for like gifting, just get in touch with me because I have a pretty good many. Speaking of, I have another one here with a Santa on it. And it's a Fit Fitz and Floyd. But I'm going to let it go for three also because that's what I've been doing my mugs for. It's a gorgeous, gorgeous cup. I don't know if it fits. I can't say it. I don't know if this brand still goes for as much as it used to. <laughs> but I do remember buying it back in the day thinking I had to have that brand. Is it Fitz and Lloyd? Or Fitz what? and Floyd. Fitz, F-I-T-Z and Floyd, F-L-O-Y-D. I can't talk half the time, but I get tongue twisted easily. Hold enough that yeah, you're right. And then when you're looking at it here and it's backwards, you're right, Dolores. It, it is. It's it's a special skill, I guess. Then I get my fingers all in the way, and I see some people just can hold it up like it's an art. Rebecca, good morning, darling. Okay, three dollars on that. I don't know what I'm still showing. I'm thinking about so glad people are coming in. I'm, you know, in my own world. All right, I have this little crock rooster crock for two dollars. It's in very good condition. 
you like. I know, um, D, you were doing roosters there for a while. I guess you probably still do. Oh, Dolores, that's so sweet. Thank you. That's precious of you. Thank you. Then I have this Precious Memories, Tell Me the Story of Jesus, 1991. I'll do it for three. It's a little ornament. I love precious moments myself. I think that's something else you like, I know. Oh, I just need to send that to her. 1991. Okay, let me tell y'all the reefs for my granddaughter. We'll, we'll kind of pause and let things catch up here a little bit. My granddaughter, Hannah, who has CRPS, y'all have heard me talk about it till y'all probably know the story better than me now. She is going for a whole month. She leaves in just a couple of days. Not rest of the month of July. She'll be having her treatments in Minnesota at the uh, Mayo Clinic. Am I saying that right? Yeah. Sometimes I get that mixed up with the MD Anderson. It's a Mayo Clinic in Rochester, and it's very expensive treatments. She, her dad, works for the government. And he does have insurance, but there's a lot of out-of-pocket expense, like staying in hotels and eating and different things. Hopefully, they will get in the Ronald McDonald house very soon. Um, if you would put that on your little prayer and thought list that they can go because that will help. They do have to, you know, give them a little something, but, you know, not it's not too much. But that that is a blessing that they, if they get to stay there. With saying all that, I'm going to sell this one today for $10. You can have this one. And if you want any, if anyone wants one made different than this, you can you know, email me and give me your order. For this one, this is a very lightweight door reef. You know, you can add things to it, little signs and different things or different flowers or different bow colors. But this will be $10. This is for the benefit for Hannah's medical expense. Then we have the double-sided wood mason jar reefs. These are going for Hannah, too. And you can have your favorite ball team. You can have Happy Fall, y'all. You can have Merry Christmas and then Happy Spring. You know, you just let us know. Trisha, good morning, good morning. This one is 15 for the wood sign. You're getting two signs for 15 because you're getting a front and a back. You just email me and let me know, you know, what you want it to say. This, again, is for the benefits for Hannah. Okay, and then we have one just larger than this for 20. Again, double sided. Again, you can have Merry Christmas on one side and Happy and the Fourth of July on the other, or you can have your ball team and or whatever you want. You just put in your orders. What about what, Heather? Oh, if you want tomorrow be the last day to let me know about whether you can have one in July or not, because they'll be leaving. Right. Heather, is that what you're saying? Otherwise, um, they'll be back in August and she'll start back up making them. But this one you can buy today. I can mail it out today. How much was the what bigger? Did she say? Mason jar? I'm sorry. Twenty. Is that what I had on? Yeah, I believe so. Yes. Twenty on the big one. Fifteen on the small one. And ten on this this one that I'm selling out right, or you can make and you can make orders for any one of these. Then she does make a big one. Uh, I'll have to get an example of it and bring it back with the um. I'll just show you the one I got. I got one right here. Hold on. This is this is for Maria. Don't tell her if she's here. Surprise. <laughs> These are 30 and she uses a lot of ribbon. You know, this is for the breast cancer awareness. I want to hurry up and move it in case Maria does come in. That size is 30 and she can make them in any color, shapes, uh, you know, like she. we had one over here the other day that was summer. You can do Christmas. You can do your ball team. 
Oh, okay, Heather, you're explaining it. Thank you so much. Give her a minute to finish explaining it. Now, the big one right there is 30. Did I say that? You know, probably two or three times. Excuse me for my eye. Uh, okay. Thank y'all for that little advertisement. <laughs> Thank you so much. Now I have six vintage red bogies. Um, placemats. I'm telling you. Maybe I can to start calling it keto brain instead of anything else. I just go blank sometimes. I'm going to do six of these for $5. They are um, the plasticky or vinyl. Wipe off. Be easy to clean. Make your Christmas table very festive. Okay, Christy, that's fine. Thank you. Christy has to take care of the parents. So. All right, so we have six of these vinyl placements for $5. If you're interested in them, just let me know. It's a good thing I got a big table in it. I'm just piling stuff up. Next, I have this tray. It's a wire, but very heavy, almost brass look. I'm sure it's just like a TJ Maxx or something tray, but it's very pretty. I have $7 on it. Let me measure it because it's pretty long. It's about 15 inches long. Good morning, Cha Cha. I'm sorry I can't, uh, if I miss anybody, it's not deliberately. Tray for seven. You want the tray, Cha Cha? Oh, you know, you're just putting it in for me. You're putting it in? Okay, I understand. I was just say, Cha Cha, you know you can have this stuff. <laughs> Seven dollars. It's very pretty. You can put your candles or your stones or, you know, and it, it sets up very level. I know y'all can't see that, but it does. It sets very level. Okay. It does have some weight to it. But, you know, I, I ship pirate ship. So I do pretty good. I, I am going to stop doing a lot of the fine chinas and stuff in a heavy box. I will have to start buying them up because I did have some breakage. And that breaks my heart. It makes me cry. <laughs> okay, next I have a green bowl. Again, a Christmas color. The avocado green. Five dollars. Let's see how wide it is. It's almost six inches across. That very vintage look. It doesn't have any chips or breaks or anything to it. Sue, I'm so glad you're here, darling. Thank you. Cha-cha, I can't believe you woke up early, but I'm glad. Y'all, cha is supposed to be having a sale. Are you still having that today, hon? The Junkin' Data Girl. Y'all got to go. She has so much stuff. It's unbelievable. Good morning, all in the attic. Okay. Story time. Y'all ready? Get your cup of coffee, tea, whatever. I got a call yesterday from my daughter in Texas. Just a mama. A restaurant by you is going out of business, and they are just about to give their stuff away, and I need some catering things. Okay, daughter, what do you need? What in the world? I'm thinking she wants one or two pans, a plate or two, maybe a tray, 300 plates, and a whole bunch of other things. Thank goodness my dad drove me with his truck with a big back to it covered because it rained. It always rains here. So we had to get at all this because it was one price. She doesn't want all 300 plates. She just wants a few plates. So I have some durable china, cameo durable china plates that if you sell on eBay, I looked them up yesterday. They're going for about $15. I'm going to sell them for a dollar a plate. <sighs> Because we got a bunch. If you wanted to make your table absolutely gorgeous for Christmas, have some durable plates. 
These are nice. These really are nice. The lady had them on her buffet. She had not, um, she had been open since the uh, pandemic, but she had not had, you know, been able to do business. So they're not used that much. Are they microwavable? They should be durable china. Hmm. I don't have a microwave hooked up right now. Mine broke. I have a new one sitting over there, you know, hadn't hooked it up yet. So I can't try it, Sarah, but you're welcome to come by and try it. Sarah's my cousin, y'all. I love her so much. But anyway, if you need a plate, you know, up to 100 or so, <laughs> restaurant plates are nice. Like I said, if you're a reseller, you got lots of room for reselling. And I have lots of plates. So y'all let me know if y'all are interested in any of them. They would make a beautiful table. I just thought I'd throw that in today, you know. Christmas in July, Merry Christmas plates, right? Okay. Is Belinda here? Is she still here? I did this special for her. Me and her are often on the channels. Uh, bidding, war bidding against each other for brooches. I have this one still in the box. Uh, it was regular $12. I'm going to start to bid at three, Belinda. <laughs> if you're interested, no pressure, darling. It is very pretty. It's new in box. I never took it out. I'm sure it's one of them I ward with. I'm trying to see if I can. It's brand new. I can't. Yeah, here we go. Has a regular latch on the back. This would make a pretty Christmas gift. I mean, I know it's July, but before you know it, we'll be going Christmas shopping. Yes, brooches. Yeah, I have your plates. Okay, uh, Christy, thanks. So, $3 for that one. And while we're on the brooches, we might as well just keep on going. I have a Santa Claus. And I'll start him at a dollar. He's just a real little costume Santa Claus, but he's in very good condition. Let's see how his little... Everybody needs a Santa Claus pin at Christmas. If I didn't have, you know, like 100... I might we keep him. <laughs> okay, Santa. For a dollar. Then I have a, I don't know if this has a brand or not on it. A candle. The brooch. It's more of a heavier metal. Let's do it at three. <laughs> Killing me. Okay, Belinda, you want the Santa? If nobody else is. <laughs> well, Cha Cha, you're going to have to war Belinda. <laughs> She's on the Santa. It's called pot metal, this? No. Oh, okay. And so, and then I had the candle or the little Christmas package. And this this one, well, it has four, 12, regular $12, and I had three. These two are three, candle or present, and Santa was a dollar. So, which one are you going for, Cha Cha? Y'all clear it up. Oh, the candle. Okay. All right, I got y'all for that. Let me write it down real quick. Now, who come over here and stole my ink pen? Ain't nobody here in this house but me. And there's a Santa pen. If I don't write pen, I'll be like, what Santa, what? Okay, cha-cha, I got a $3 candle. Thank y'all so much, ladies. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I did immediately think of Belinda this morning. I should have thought of Cha Cha too, because she's like me. She loves brooches also. Okay, let's think of something else. We'll show you the 
Cancun Island mug. And I have $2 on it. It has a turtle. Look, Sarah, turtles. <laughs> she loves turtles. I do too, really. $2 on the Cayman Island mug, if you're interested in that. And who doesn't need a Santa Claus teapot? And I, I, don't, I think I had a price on him. Let's start him at $5. So cute. It says, East West Distributing Company, hand wash only, not for microwave, Sarah. Can't put him in the microwave. I guess he's probably more or less just a core. I guess you can maybe pour some hot water in him. He's sweet. $5 on him. Oh, you have a chair. Oh, okay, cool. Oh, yeah, I thought y'all put your time and all about your sale. You're um, Eastern Standard Time, right? So put both times because you know I need you to explain it to me. I had this little trinket box for two dollars. Does have a, a little hole in it. And I was telling the other day about how we do. We used to do incense and stuff, but you could put your bath salts in here and, or whatever you wanted to. It's made in USA. Two dollars. It's kind of a more of a little. Yeah, no, it's ceramic. Okay, I was thinking it felt kind of pottery like. Oh, of course. So four twenty. Eastern Standard Time. Okay, so that's three my time, right? Three twenty my time. Why twenty? Anyway, okay. All right, next I have this adorable little pelican mug. Look, he has tennis shoes on. They all do, and they're they're do oh they're said that they're doing holiday caroling. Look how sweet that is. Three dollars for this little mug. Y'all might be saying, well, she's showing all her Christmas today. Y'all, I'm not. This ain't a drop in the bucket. And this says love mug. Let's see. Oh, it has the Roman numerals, 50, 60, 70, 87. If I'm saying them right, it's 1987. Oh, okay. Okay, Cha-Cha, I got it. Thank you. Three dollars for this little mug. I'll just do another Christmas message in reach. You have this very shiny, glossy Santa Claus candle holder. He has all kind of little holes, little stars where your candle would flicker and show light. Of course, you can always use the little electric ones. If you're like me and scared of the fire. And I, you know, I live in a wooden house, so that's like treated with some kind of oil that would burn, go up really fast. I've been, been told that all my life, so I'm scared to burn a real candle. Anyway, this little thing, well, I'm going to put in for three also. It's the, that's the number for the day, most of the week. And you just put your little candle in here. Look, he's holding little toys and little gifts. You know, I hope Miss Pat wakes up. She's the one that uh, really wanted Christmas stuff. I just now thought about that. But she, you know, it's in a different time zone. I think it's like maybe the middle of the night there. So maybe I don't hope she wakes up. <laughs> maybe she'll watch me later. Thank you, Sarah. Thank you. Okay. Let's see. Let me show something not Christmas here. Oh, I do have this pretty candle holder. And it can go for three dollars. It's a very, very, very thin, fine glass, and it has that uh, avocado green look to it. It's not really showing up. It's showing up more brown looking in mine, but I don't know if it, what it's showing in yours. But it is a green. Okay, $3 on that candle. 
All right, let's do a little, this can be a little nut bowl or a little cheese bowl. It says snowman collection made in China, hand painted. We'll do three on him. Oh, I see his little nose has a little bit of like a little white spot. It doesn't really feel broken, might be. Let's do him for two dollars. This his nose looks like it's got a little doink on his nose. He'd be sweet for the where's uh Jackie? She needs to put some cashews in here for her little guy. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Am I missing something? Santa. Oh, the Santa. Okay, I got you. Thank you. Let me put this. And it's this, right? Just say yes or no. No. Santa. Probably so. I was on it so long. I do have several sets of Christmas glasses. They're not in here. They're still in their packages. If anybody needs any Christmas glasses, y'all can email me about that too. Oh, and I have this beautiful little angel. It looks like it has like the Thomas Kincaid look to the middle. It doesn't say that that's what it is, but look at her little feet sticking out. I just got tickled seeing that. It says, joy to the world. Little angel. We'll do her for three. Look at her little wings. As far as I can tell, she's in perfect condition. Let's see what her little tag says here. Heavenly angel Christmas ornament. Joy to the world. Mr. Sud says something too. Um, I guess doesn't really. Can't see. Just a little scribbling. Maybe a signature or something. $3 for her. She's precious. She's got a lot of glitter. I picked up my cousin yesterday and told her glitter was my favorite color. I love glitter. <laughs> we'll go from angels to pigs. <laughs> oh, no. I sent it to you, Jane, darling. Check your email. If you don't see it, let me know, okay? I have the little pigs for three dollars. You have a little farmhouse, country core, shabby chic, or if you're like me and you just like little piggies, three dollars. I ordered some little piggies from somebody last night. Then I have these little silver. I don't know that they're real silver. They're silver plated. They're very heavy. Candlestick holders. I have them for 10. They are very pretty. Tell you how tall they are. You have a thing of pigs with wings? Oh, about four inches, right at four inches tall. They would make a Christmas table gorgeous. And as y'all remember, I have a lot of red candles, you know, the wax candles. Maybe closer to the cooler weather, or if y'all have cooler weather, y'all may want them, because I am kind of am afraid they may melt. Somebody mentioned that to me. I had not thought about it. Okay, so the set of these. I know that it's like a silver, you know, on top, because you can shine it right up. It'll just shine. But I don't think maybe they're not like solid silver or anything like that. Just silver plated. Okay. And then I'm about to run out of room here on this big old table. Okay, if you do any assemblages, I immediately thought of Miss Sarah on uh, the Thrift U. Jane, let me know if you can't get in, darling. Okay. These are the, they say Tiny Deer. And they have multiple um, deer in each package. And I think I counted it. I know over. 
over a half dozen or more, maybe closer to eight. And I'll do this whole little bag of these little miniature little gear. If you want the whole package for three dollars. Oh, I see Jane. Yay! So I was for the little tiny reindeer. Let me take one out and see if I was waiting on her to come. And they get what that they had 54 cents each on them. <laughs> some of them's like a whole package, and some of them they're still down in here. See, like there's three, so that's three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Look, there's close, maybe closer to a dozen. Oh, the deer, okay. Okay. That. Let's see if we can get her. Jane, darling, you are a trooper and a half. <laughs> You're my hero if you can come in and do anything and not make me cry, hopefully. Let's let Jane have a turn. How are y'all? Darling, how, first of all, how are you? Hurt. <laughs> and be truthful. And and sorry, my hair is like all over the place. <laughs> Everybody doing good. Don't you apologize for a thing. <laughs> Oops, I just broke the pig's ear. Glad to be mine. I just broke my little pig's ear. I broke. I, I broke a set of salt and pepper shakers. <laughs> And they were pretty oh, too. Well. I broke. A I set love him with a broken. Yeah. I just broke a set of salt and pepper shakers. I'm sorry. It's okay. We are. Ow. We are happy to see you, and don't you do a minute more than you can. You holler, Uncle, the minute you need to go. <laughs> okay. Okay. But until um, then, until then, it's your turn for a minute. <laughs> okay. Y'all welcome um, to Miss Jane. If any of you don't know her, she has the Doggone Vintage channel. What is it? Don't go, Doggone Happy Vintage? Tell him yep, your channel. That's my boy. <laughs> that's my boy. He's laying in there sleeping now. No, he just stretched out. It's raining and he thinks it's like oh. time to sleep all day. <laughs> Nap time. Well, welcome, Jane. We love you. Thank you, and thank you for having me. Oh, anytime. Well, I, um, what I came up with is, oh, first, does anybody know Dave's life? It was, the information was never set. So if anybody knows who this is, let me know, please. Because I haven't heard I, that one. Dave's life. Um, me neither. I've been getting a lot. Second, Sue, if you're still here, do I owe you this donkey? <coughs> I think I sent it to the wrong Sue. This one has the gold tooth. So. If this is yours, you, I'll get it out right away. I don't know if she's still here or not. Hi, everybody. Okay. Oh, as long as I've been straight, I'm okay. Yeah, if, if that's not Sue's, I'll sell it again because I got okay. I'll Please get it out to you immediately. Okay, the first thing I have are these little glosses. Look at those shine. Whoops. Oh, I love them. There we go. They're just small. They're like um pretty little juice glosses, maybe for um 
I would use them as juice glasses, maybe for Christmas morning, um, or eggnog glasses. These eggnog, are really, really nice. It's got the starburst on the bottom, the diamond oh. cut, and there's four of them, and doggone it, I, ouch, I forgot. You're going to hear ouch a lot. Um, yes, Wexford. Okay, they set up here so you guys can determine how tall they are because I lost my ruler somewhere, and I know it's here. I just don't They're know fun. where it's at. And, um... Y'all can have these four glasses. I think these are like cordial glasses, wine, you know, with the decanter. But I don't drink, so, and probably should sometimes, but I don't <laughs> drink. So I look at them as pretty juice glasses. Can you imagine tomato juice or orange juice? And these four glasses. Oh, me too, V8. Hard on the kidneys, yes, but I love V8. Okay, so these little glasses, you can have all four, if you like, for $8 for all four glasses. And that's my first one. Keep and going. As long as you want to. And okay. Like it. Damn. You didn't hear me whisper that word, right? No, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> didn't hear nothing. Okay. Nothing. I have a very large, the lace on the top, hobnail, face. Oh. Um. This Love one that. has no markings on the bottom because I thought it was Cleveland. But I do believe because Jeanette Glass didn't mark a lot of their stuff. And it's dirty inside, but I'll, whoops, I'll clean it out. And I do believe this is Jeanette Glass. Okay, now I'm going to set this on my shoulder because this is nice and large. There's no chips, no cracks, no nothing. It's beautiful. It really is pretty. And that's on my shoulder like this. <laughs> okay, this face can be yours. For $15 if you like this vase. And okay, because I don't have another table, I have to bend real slow one way or go real slow the other way. So there's my salt and pepper shakers I broke. <laughs> I'll bless it. I shattered them. Um, then I have... Dang. Okay. These are lead, genuine lead crystal. 24... Wow. 24% pro in Western... Germany. These were made in Western Germany. Is it Eastern Germany that you don't find a lot? You find a lot from the West, but not the East, I think. And here they are. Now, I don't have a taper candle to show you, so I'm going to use my marker. But there you go. These are a set, and the dust is all free. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> But here's the set. I'm going to get it up here where you can see it. These are lead crystal. They do go boing. 
Maybe. Get back here. I hope oh, you can hear yes. it. Okay. And whoa, now you heard it. And this <laughs> one still has its sticker on it. The lead crystal sticker to mm, let you know crazy. that it's genuine. And I love crystal. Oh, I never did until now. And oh boy, D thinks, okay, hold on. D thinks that this vase is fitting. And D is so much more knowledgeable than me. Right. And she, she has so, the knowledge. She is so dang smart. And so, um, Belinda, um, D says this is fit, and, and I believe that I believe her more than me. So, this is yours, Belinda. That is thank, you. thank you, thank you, thank you. And let me mark this. Or please take your minutes, time, Jane. And take CRS your time. Will oh, yeah. in, and <laughs> CRS would be like. Yep, she forgot again. Okay, I have that one. Thank you so much. Anyway, if anybody likes these lead crystal, we can do one. We can do both. But I promise you with both of them, with another piece in the center, for example, and I don't know if I can do this, but I'm going to try I'm not here. If you set them together, see what I'm saying? It's very pretty. And mixing the glass, whoops, the other way around, but you get the general idea. Mix, I like to mix colors and I like to mix different textures and glass. I know I try and I learn a lot from you, D. I learn a lot. So D says this is Fenton. Belinda, is that still okay with you? If that's still okay with Belinda, we'll keep going. These little holders, little candle holders. Now, if you don't want to put a taper candle and make it real tall, you if you know what i'm talking about home interior used to send sell little Ow. votive cups. little votive cups you can put the votive cups they fit perfect and then put your colored candles in those i think your your channel is what she means hmm. yes it would be Yes, you're right. It would be sad to separate them. So these, this set, um, if you like this set, and I promise you that I'll get all the dust off, unless you want my free dust. But <laughs> <laughs> this set is $16 for the set. If anybody's interested, and I'm on movies. I put Cha Cha and uh, Jane's, but I didn't want to put yours without asking you, D. So, okay, great. Thank you. Oh, okay, thank you. And, and anyone I'm, else wants to leave their link, say I can. Um, you need a break, Jane? Or you got something else? Go ahead. I if you want to. I was showing for an hour. I'm just happy okay. I found my deep, my my donkey's home, and what what, what number for the last thing you showed? The or candle what price. Six yes, ma'am. Uh, all in the attic. Okay, she all in the attic. Want some? Okay, I'm gonna mark that. 
Yes, I want Jane to take it easy. We are going to just lay back and be relaxed and let her take it easy and show some things as long as she can. Do not um, push yourself. Please. Marianne, um, would you please resend your information? To, um, I'm having a trouble with emails for some reason or not getting the information I had it before I asked Teresa and Teresa sent it except for I'm not getting it to you I don't know what's wrong or why Goodness. but um I'd appreciate it hon if you could please it's send real me easy to put a wrong letter here or there or dot in the wrong place I had to learn that when I was starting out Yes, don't forget it's doggone happy dot co. Don't forget the dot co. If nothing else, I'll kick that dot co out if I have to. Um, <laughs> at gmail.com. Ow. Okay. Anybody care for a pretty swan? Oh my goodness. This swan is clear glass. Okay. There is no marks on it, absolutely at all. But I think that this would make such a pretty little soap dish um, for your scrubbers at your kitchen sink if you'd like oh to gosh. put them in there. Okay. Um, what else? I'm looking around the house. What else? Um, just a little trinket dish, your rings and your earrings at night. If you're like me, I sleep in all mine. I've got what 22 in each ear earrings. My goodness, Jane, you're so sweet. I okay, love Denise, it. Thank you. I think I have yours, Denise, but I'll make sure, and I appreciate it very much, on Very, very much. Okay, so if anybody liked this one, I'm going to set him up on my shoulder. Okay, he's just right there to my glass, my glasses right here. And I think he's just gorgeous. If I would put him in my bathroom, it would be broke in a heartbeat. No problem. So I'm going to get rid mm -hmm. of him or sell him, however you want to say it. But he is pretty. And to decorate him to suit your bathroom, tie a ribbon around his neck. <laughs> you could tie just I got all kind of ideas thinking about it. It's gorgeous. Oh, it is. He's so it's pretty at the holidays. Some lights or yeah. some balls or something in it. Gorgeous. Yeah, huh? Christmas bulbs. Little Christmas bulbs. Okay. If you would like this little guy, he is 10 bucks. If anybody would like him. No way. That's a steal, y'all. That's gorgeous. Okay. Hmm. Okay, so there's three. While you do it, I'm going to bend a little. Oh, Jane. Okay. Oh. So you, you, you're for next moment. Okay. Jane, please. I feel I'm so okay. bad for you. Not the Wish first time I broke away. my back. No, not the not first okay. time I broke it. Oh, yeah. Has a broken back. She's so tough. Oh, please remember her in your thoughts and prayers, please. I rolled out of bed <sighs> one yes, time. I'm my hero. Broke my back rolling out of bed. Oh, gracious. Okay. I have in front of me four little houses that you put your lights in. Your little candle lights, or you can even put, if you have the uh, lights that are like on a string, you can put some in here. They have the little holes where they'll glow. 
And if you put a little a real candle in here, smoke will come out the chimney. So I'm told. I'm gonna do the little. I got a whole. I got four of them. On all four of them. Oh gosh, goodness! I'm sorry. The dog got scared me to death. It's okay. It's Heather. It's okay, Bobo. I about jumped out of skin. <laughs> Can do. Oh goodness! I'll do all four of them for eight dollars. Come in. Okay, hold on, just one minute, y'all. Let me mute this and tell them to come in. Come in. I don't know. I do. Maybe I'm sorry, y'all. Give me one. Give me one second. Your doggy made my doggy bark. <laughs> I love you, Belinda. You are not bossy. I just get so bored sitting on the dang couch. I sleep on the couch. I sit on the couch. And it's like, uh, I got to do something. I'm like, I'm so dang hyper. Your doggy made my doggy bark. I'm sorry. He reached the door. I'm sorry. Why don't it, be It was sorry. a grandchild and they wouldn't just come in. Mm -mm. Oh, yes, Jane, please look what Melinda's message and please take heed to it. Okay, I have four of these houses. Um, I will do all four of them for $8 and I'm going to show them to you. They all have the chimneys. They all have the little place for the candle to go in. This is the bakery, the village end. You would have you a really cute little vill village. You're not bossy, Belinda. You just care about her. That's right. And this one is a warehouse. So we have a bakery, a warehouse, an end, and a grocery store. Yeah, we all need a little grocery store, especially at the holidays. So if you want these four little houses, you can have them for $8. If you just said, just want one of them, we'll do it for three, I guess. And I'll pour them for eight. Okay. I mean, not break them. It will kick them while they go. Okay. Again, if you're just coming in, I have this little reef that I will sell today for $2. This is, goes from benefit for medical bills, which all of my stuff does, but this is particularly being made just for this trip. That's the way they're doing it. Also, I have the box vintage candles that we, we I lit them up while ago and showed everybody that they work. And we, oh, if I don't drop the light and break it, we're going to start the bid off for them for $8. I'm just kind of going over a few things. I don't want Jane to get wore out. I'm okay. No, you're not, but you're just. Tough. <laughs> oh goodness, and I love you so much. Well, I love you. Right. I know, darling, you're so sweet. I have this little green pitcher for eight dollars. My chat completely stopped. Are y'all here? Yeah, I my chat. Y'all did it. It makes me think like in my mouth. It's okay, but I just. Right. Mm, let's see. My granddaughter brought me a Diet Coke. Wasn't that sweet of her? I can't believe that thing's happening. She ought to still be in a car seat. <laughs> Again, I have the plates. You're still here, Sarah? Cool, cool. The durable china cameo plate for a dollar each. And uh, you can get up to a hundred or more from me. <laughs> Jane, you let me know when you're ready now because I showed a bunch already today. Okay. I have the willow tree. You're you're ready? Whenever you finish, right there. Okay. All right, darling. Three dollars for her.
Jane is a hero. She sure is. Let's give her another turn. Okay, y'all. I'm happy you come on here with me. You miss it. Okay. These are absolutely gorgeous. These are hand painted. They also are signed. But y'all have to tell me what they are because I cannot find information about these. Okay, so here comes the first. Get it turned around here. These are so pretty. But I don't know what they are. Okay, oh, it, yeah. all the way around. Wait, I gotta go that way. Okay, I got it. And right there is the signature. Wait, oops, there. And there's two of these. They're now the new comments are coming up. Um, yeah, I'm too I, excited. I don't know what you call these. Espresso cups, maybe? I don't know, but they're old. They're just little dainty ones. Okay. If anybody would like these little cups, and I'll show you where they sat. They sat. Oh, right there. Right at my glasses. At the arm of my glasses. From my shoulder to my glasses. That's how big they are. These are so, so pretty. And I love that. The blue is not royal blue or yeah. it's cobalt blue. The blue is such a pretty blue. It's true blue. <laughs> Those are gorgeous. They are, and they're different. Okay, if anybody would like these little cups, these two for the set are $8. And Irish coffee. Awesome. I never drink Irish coffee. That's awesome. Thank you. Amazing. Put some more <laughs> today. I think I need it. <laughs> to put some alcohol in your coffee. <laughs> then I have, and she's so sweet. I don't know if you all like Indians, but she oh. has a look at that. She has her baby. So sweet. There we go. Isn't she pretty? There she is. She is a Nesco. Nope. So sorry. She's Homeco. Homeco. Number 1447. She has one issue. And right here, somebody knocked her feather off. But Aww. I like her just the way she is. And I can I go out in the it yard. doesn't bother me. A, yeah, or I can go out in the yard and find a feather. I got enough birds. <laughs> Big birds. Red tail hawks, eagles, you name it. They're there. Wow. I did that. Okay, so if you'd like the Indian with her baby. Okay, she is $8. And there she is. Little, it just takes a little rum. <laughs> I'm reading that. 
Well, thank you, Christy. That's kind of you. Thank you. Okay, the next one is this lady. And she has a doggy with her. With her basket. She has a shawl. She has... <laughs> she's got ducks coming out of her basket. Right there. Little baby ducks. And her doggy. Following her right along. <clears throat> she's so, so pretty. Cute. It is. And I looked for the old man. But I couldn't find him. I think somebody might have broke him. But on the bottom... It says Mary, I don't know what her last name is, but this is a homemade piece, and it's dated 1979. Oh, wow. If you would like her, she is also $8, and I'll set her up here. She's pretty tall. Okay, and I'll go one more before I have to bend again. She is so pretty. She, she's she got the dead duck. <laughs> she must be going to have a duck. Because oh, she's got she the is. dead duck. Okay, the way. That's supper in her hand. And then I have this Good little job. bowl. This little bowl is dated 1984. Four. And I'm assuming again it's a home like a crafter's piece. However, you say that, um, because I used to do this all the time. On the back it says J E M C 1984. It's just a dainty little Isn't that pretty? The roses are so pretty. They, I know you probably can't see it, but wait. If I can turn it up right. There, it says 1984. And it just has roses. And the rose inside. The little dish is... Six dollars if anybody's interested. It's so dainty. And I like that it's not busy. If that makes sense. I like that the pattern isn't so busy. My house is busy. It's got mm -hmm. like all wood. And the wood is a lot of oak and a lot of pine and that knotty pine so it's all busy i like that this is not so busy and it's six dollars okay there's three jane and if no one if no one's interested in the people figurines i want both of them the lady and the both ladies. They're both ladies, huh? Yeah. Yes, ma'am. They're both ladies. Yes. I collect the, the figurines like that, so I would like to add those to my collection if no one else isn't wanting them. I don't see I don't, anybody in the chat. Me neither. I don't see nobody, so thank you, Teresa. Okay. They're yours. You're welcome. Thank you. Okay, did you have something else, or was you done? Um... If everybody likes figurines, I have figurines some more. I love them. Don't show me no more. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I, like I don't that. have any like those two. I usually do more of the Victorian lady, but I do have some different ones, like the older ladies and stuff in mine, and I, I don't have those two. So I do now. Are you okay with that or feather? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. I that that just shows she's got a story and been loved. I don't. It doesn't bother me that, that anything. She's still, that's still, the still, way I am. Uh, that's exactly got right. A story. She's got a story. That's exactly right. Mm -hmm. 
Exactly. And Martinez. Good morning, Jonathan. I didn't want to interrupt her while I go when I was. Hi, Jonathan. Okay, you want me to do one more? No, it's just up to you. I'm like, to see if you have one more. You want me to? No, I got one more. Your I can do it. Okay, yes, ma'am. I'll do tell y'all a quick story. Two years ago, this coming August, my grandson at that time was 16. And he is so tech teacher. This thing digs into my collarbone. Um, he got his first job through Votech, and his Votech teacher, um, he loves carpentry. So he went to work. It was like a hundred degrees outside. Actually, I think it was seventy-eight. <coughs> and he's only six. He was only sixteen. He was up on a platform. There was no scaffolding, no way to hold him in. He was just mm. on a platform on the side of a house. Now, they drove a pipe into the ground to release the gases. Because when you live in the mountains, you got a lot of gas. And it explodes underground because of all the mines and such. So they drove the pipe in to release the gases. He fell 16 feet, hit the ground. He, what he did is he was dehydrating and he got a real sharp pain in his belly. He doubled over, got dizzy and fell. When he fell 16 feet, he lit. Just like this, beside that pipe. He was up against that pipe. If he would have fallen or moved a quarter of an inch, he would have impaled on top of that pipe. He broke all the vertebrae, everything in his back, except for his spine. His spine was untouched, but he broke mm. Every vertebrae in his back, he broke this, Heavens. shattered this shoulder, shattered his whole collarbone. Because I don't know what you call this. And they rushed him into emergency surgery. And it took 20 doctors, a team of emergency 20 Ooh. doctors. To put that boy My back goodness. together. Today, he graduated in May oh, and in June. He is almost 19. Um, he graduated with high honors, with three scholarships, mm -hmm. and... Um, $1,500 worth in a check to go to Lowe's to buy tools to get him started in his own business. So Thank in the goodness. fall, he's going to start taking classes. Now, he's my hero. Oh, man. Well, you don't have to be tougher than him, that's for sure. <laughs> he, he, oh, you're precious. He that is, is quite amazing. That's a miracle. All right. He is. Sometimes we have to just look up and know that that was God that kept him off the pole. Thank from him. Oh my him God. The pole. A quarter of an inch he would have impaled yeah, on. Just got to look up it. and know. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm glad that he's doing better and going to start his own business. My goodness. God Ooh. was with him that day. He had a guardian angel that day. He's not done. He wasn't done with him, was he? My no, ma'am. No, ma'am. Okay, you want me to do one more? I'll do one more. Um, it's just like you. Hold on. Let me get it. Well, I have something special. Wait, 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 wait. I'll do something while you ease around. You, you okay. take the time and I'll. 
do one more here. He's right here. Okay. Go have me crying, Jane. No way. Belinda, you had a question. <clears throat> you had a question. I showed these all lit up, but I'll do it again. Earlier. What? That's the, the one has to come out for it to fit in the box. We, we learned that earlier, too. But I, I got to plug in right here by me. Do all work, Belinda. Well, this little bulb was working earlier, but I guess it's blown out. These are just little night light bulbs. Let's See, that does work. It's blown out. So I'm going to just have to replace one night light bulb. And I believe I have some. I'm almost 100% positive I'll put you one in there. So you do want this, Belinda, right? You said if it worked. And plug it. It's blinding me. It's probably blinding y'all, too. Woo. Yep. I'm just batting my work now. I'm going to have to put you two in there. Anyway, the... the the candelabra works. <laughs> that was your question. And let me get my. Oh, yeah, Heather and them leave Monday. Got a funny to me about that. So that's Monday. All right, Belinda, I had you for those. Eight dollars. Thank you so much. Okay, got you down for that. All right, let me show you something else. I have four of the Scotty Dog glasses. I know these are from the 80s because Susie King had them all over her table in the 80s. And they may have been before that, but I do know in the 80s they were there. I have a set of four of these for $10. And they're the little Scotty Dogs. Okay. Then I have a set of four, four of these 1960 nanny glasses. What is in there? I have an aunt that we call the kids nanny. And I have a set of these, and I'll do them for ten also. And they the, that 1970 gold harvest gold, I believe we called it back then. Color, almost an amber, but more of a harvest gold. And so four of the 1960 or four of the Scotty Dog, $10 a set. And I'll show you a big ring that's sitting right here before I put her. Cherish Teddies. And it's in the snow sledding. They have this little piece of rope is like a real piece of rope. They're in the snow. Their little scarves are blowing in the wind. And I have $3. Dawn, good morning, good morning, good morning. Um, put your channel in there too, Dawn. In the in the um chat. <clears throat> if Hi, that doesn't Dawn. work, come back and put it in the comments afterwards. Okay, Jane, are you ready, darling? Yep. Sir. Cindy. Hey, Cindy Twin. I might have bought some of some of them from you, but I, I don't have nowhere to put them no more. I'm running out of room. <laughs> I done run out of room. <laughs> okay. Me too, Here darling. Is. Me too. This can be a milk pitcher, a water pitcher, but I think this is just so, so pretty. It sets like this on the other side it doesn't have this is all hand painted it is crazy it's got a lot of crazing on it right here it doesn't have any but all the way around it does um i can't read exactly what it says I don't think it actually says anything. I just think this is so pretty. And it sets up on my shoulder like this. And it, I love the way it sets like this. You could have it. Whoa. 
This way. Sorry. This picture is $10 if anybody's interested. That's beautiful. It is pretty. It's it's an old piece. It's dirty inside, but when you go to the stores, they're all dirty. <clears throat> it says USA on the bottom. The light just caught it. USA. And there you go. It's a it's got some weight to it. It's like not a piece. It's like um more pottery like it's heavy made okay mm. and dang then i know you're probably not going to be able to see this because of my lights but it's it looks like it's eight o'clock at night outside with the rain but this does glow and it is pink I don't know if you can see it, but I turned the light out to make sure I was right. And it does come from the bottom. And I promise you, I know you can't see it, probably, but especially around the top. It glows around the top. It's very, very pretty. Oh, wow. How gorgeous. What's cool is it's pink. And somebody kept telling me that pink does not glow. Uh-huh. This mm, goes. I didn't know that. Wow. And I got beautiful little, like, sherbet glasses from D. And they are pink depression. And, oh, I love them so much. They're in my collection because I love depression glass. And my little um, sherbet glasses, they glow. From the bottom, the bottom does glow. And, and the same as this, it does glow. And if anybody's interested in this face, it's very pretty. The design is like a basket when you look through it, sort of. Or like cattails like leaves of cattails and it has the thumbprint where they push into the glass with their thumb or finger and then it has the stripes on the top this is twenty dollars if anybody's interested and oh are you okay i'm not worried about the glass i'm worried about you I was worried about the face. <laughs> I wasn't. I was worried about you. It's set up. It'll set like this tall. So it's a nice piece. It's a nice size piece. And they tell me that you can get um, fairy lights that are black light. I can't. I haven't found oh. them yet. But you're supposed to be able you're to get have them to look into that. that. I know, and if you put fairy lights in here, and they're black lights, all your uranium will glow. Will glow. Well, if somebody yeah. hasn't thought of that, they need to. I wonder wow, if you can find them at, like, Halloween time, like a small strand of black light, you think? Wouldn't that be pretty? Yeah. yeah. Absolutely, and I love pink. I do, too. And... I find absolutely no chips, nothing, no cracks. There's the bottom. Now, the bottom you can more see through. The more, the farther it goes down, the less pink oh, it Amazon. is. Amazon. D says you can get them on and Amazon. Okay, Sarah, Amazon. order me up some. <laughs> yep, me too. Okay, this is $20. No, me too, Melinda. Ooh, I'm going to hit Amazon as soon as we're done. And. Linda, I'm fixing the end so that she quit hurting. Here is 
a beautiful frosted diamond cut compote. It does not have a lid. It's not made to have a lid. Now, it, it is a mold because it has two seams. Mm -hmm. Okay? This is pretty. You could do so much. I saw last night maybe because I, I get so bored. I fall asleep and I doze off. But somebody last night was selling glass vegetables and fruits and they were selling it for the banana she sold for four bucks i could i bought it that. huh <laughs> and i bought it it was me that Did bought you it the banana? <laughs> awesome i it knew was, i saw that this was <laughs> up here. yes I it knew was I, chris i was wondering <laughs> if i was dreaming so. Okay, and this is how tall mm -hmm. this is. So cute. That's the diamond funny. cuts around the bottom as well. Okay, and I suppose you could use this for a margarita goblet. Oh, yeah. Yes, you could. That'd be it. Whoa, one of those <laughs> and I wouldn't get a quarter of it down. Okay, if you would like this, this is, there's no chips on the bottom. It's just dirty. I always wear sweat shorts or sweat pants to the thrift store because I end up on my hands and knees rooting through everything. Okay, and, and today's then, half price, no, that was just, no, what is today? Thursday. Thinking, I think I've been thinking it was Friday all day long. I think I said that when we came on. So it's Thursday, so it is half price day. You know, if I said it was Friday oh, earlier, yeah. please look over me. It's half price senior day today. It's Thursday. Well, I'm nervous good. when I come on by myself. I think I thought it was Friday when I first came on. I don't have to worry about the days. I don't have anything to do anymore. Yay. Yeah, <laughs> I earned the right to forget what I earned the right to forget what day it is. <laughs> That's right. Me too. That's silly. Yes, ma'am. Okay. This is ten dollars. If anybody's interested, well worth it. Okay, that's three. Okay, sweet Jane. Okay, well, we're I'm coming up on our time ending. I'm gonna okay. show two things, and then I'm gonna come back to you and let you show what you want to, and then we're gonna end. Okay. So I'm gonna show okay. two and then come back to you. I have oh, this coffee that, yum. I'm sorry, what Christy? That uh <laughs> the last thing that Jane had, you could actually they have alcoholic slushies that would probably fit just right in there. And you can just scoop them up with there a spoon you go. and put it in that would be perfect. Or you could eat ice cream if you was me. <laughs> okay, I have a coffee cup. It's a pink color with a purple. It says coffee yum. If you like your coffee. I prefer hot tea, but I drink iced coffee every once in a while. I'm not a big coffee drinker, but I have $3 on it. I do like pink, though. And next, I have a little Avon bottle. It has this box. It says fine porcelain hand decorated with 22 karat gold trim um, produced in Brazil for Avon in 1979. And if you love strawberries, which I do, but I, I have to not collect everything. It does have its stopper. This would be for the talcum powder. Back in the, you know, 79, it would have come in and it would have had a box of the powder. The powder is gone. Apparently, they just used the powder and never used this because it was still in its little cover up here. But um, I have $5 on this.
I know we do have some strawberry lovers out there. It does say on the bottom, porcelain, 22 carat, 1978. Did I say? Well, on the bottom of this, it actually says 78. So maybe this got made a year before they put it in the packaging. Aww. It is still very pretty. Okay. Pretty. Yeah, it's for powder and powder. It says 1978 on the bottom, $5. And that's it. We're going to let Jane end up with this thing, and then we'll tell y'all all bye because I'm not wanting her to overdo it. And she can come back on with me since today's not Friday. She can come back tomorrow if she wants to. Yeah, that would be great. I'd love that. If you're able. Here you go, darling. Okay. Well, I don't know if everybody's heard, but um, your thrift stores or whatever you want to call them, they've done lost their minds on prices. You can't even That's buy. That's why I have to go and have price day. See, they won't let, they don't do that here. We never get oh, half man. price. Uh-uh. And they don't give seniors. I would never go again. They don't give senior discounts. They don't do nothing here. It's all about them. Okay, so I have salt and pepper shakers that I didn't break. And here's my little birds. There's the pepper, the salt, And my little bird's cute. And their beaks are still intact. Let me set it right here. They just remind, they just look happy. And they do have their stoppers. It's a sticker or something on there. Whatever it was, it was somebody's initials. Okay, there's the stoppers. Wouldn't they be cute sitting on the table or on your stove? Just sitting on the counter yes. for decoration? Because they make me happy. They would make okay? me happy too. I like them. I know, they're cute. Okay, if you like this set, they're eight dollars. There's no chips, no cracks. Still got their stoppers. Um, then I have. If I could quit shaking, I'd be all right. Um, then I have this. So it was made in Thailand. Oh, yeah. that's gorgeous. It's just got a little yeah. opening. Um, I not ever gonna say for sure, but I think this is an oil for your cooking oil or for your um olive oil. I even use coconut oil in my hair, so this would every once in a while. This would be cool in the bathroom even. And I do have a cork for it. I've got two of these. Um, one I have vegetable oil in. The other one I have olive oil in. And the number on this is 1638. Four, four, four. And there you can see it was made in Thailand. Ah, this camera. Can't get it right. Okay. This is $10 if you like this. It's beautiful blue. Cobalt blue. It is not clear, but it is. Yeah, you can't see through that. But when the light hits it, the blue 
it just bounces around. It's really pretty. Okay. And I push everything out of my way. I have. I need a bigger a house where I can have all that stuff in. I, I might have to get a bigger house. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. I already took over Isaac's room and Lily's room. And now I got to find one someday for the for Gracie because she's a little too little to come and stay with Graham just yet. She's little, but she's rolling. Yeah. She's rolling. Old oh, she over is. The place. Oh. He's, she's adorable, and she's so kicked back, laid we back. Grands. You can play with her all Good you want. Day. She just smiles until oh. something really irritates her. And then she lets out a war hoop you ain't never <laughs> heard before. This is my hard. goodness. Oh, that's beautiful. Amber carnival gloss. Isn't that pretty? Yes, ma'am. And it's got the thumbprint or fingerprint, whatever you want to say. And I'll set this pretty thing. This does not have a lid. It wasn't made to have a lid. Oh, my goodness. I can see that on my fall table. Isn't that pretty? Oh, oh, yeah. It's not too big. Oh it's God. not too little. It's one of those things, it's just right. It's very dirty. And the glass is so pretty. The, there's no chips, no cracks that I can feel anywhere. This is quite an older piece. I remember my grandma having one like this. Aww. Okay, and if anybody's interested in this, you can have this today for ten dollars. And the chat in and out, so holler at me, okay? Because I can't see the chat again. Oh, okay. Thank you. Okay, how about a lidded, hinged little trinket dish? <laughs> Is it that pretty? I think this is adorable. It is frosted. The gold is perfect on it. There's no chips. There's no cracks. There you go. Um... Other than the sticker, there's no marks on the bottom. And I don't mean sticker. I mean sticker from the store. Yep. There's no markings on the bottom. Mm -hmm. But it sure is pretty. Set it is like pretty. On my shoulder. I love those flowers. I got it backwards, too. You would like to have this? This is $6. It has a really nice hinge back, too. It's neat. It's got some, like, it's not, it looks dainty, but it's not made. It's more of a heavier glass. It looks dainty. It's just not made real dainty. And here's one of my big boo-boos. How about a Walt Disney Mickey Mouse mug? Oh, wow. Um, you, ha yep, you have Angelic Walt for Disney six. Mickey I'm sorry, for What's that? I'm sorry. I missed what you said. 
Angelic won't sit for six dollars. What was that? The trinket box? I missed what it was. Yes, I it was it. yes, box. I believe that's what it was. Okay. Thank you, Christy. Let me mark it real Forgot. fast. Yeah, start talking. You guys know my brain. It's angelic. Oh, will you take your uh, All right. At least we can see you, Debbie. I'm so sorry that happened last night. I have, we worked and worked and worked and worked to get you on there. Oh. She could see us. We couldn't see her. Oh. It happens sometimes. Yeah, and I don't know why that's so weird. Mm hmm So I was texting her, telling her what... They said, try this. They said, try this. Nothing worked. I'm going to set that back there. Here's Mickey Mouse. Now, this is a nice mug. No chips, no cracks. It says Walt Disney World. Disney. So it's original. But here's where I boo-booed. On the back of this, it says Morgan. And I did not see it. It had newspaper stuffed in it. I did not see it until I pulled the paper out when I got home. But it says Morgan. But I think if you mm -hmm. were to put something in here, flowers. Um, My flower frog fits down in there. And it would be cool to put flowers in it. You would never. It's on the back. All you would see is Mickey. He's so cute. And he's not scratched up at all. Like this glass would be easy to scratch here. But it's not scratched. And Morgan. <laughs> is it heavy? No. Not. It feels like a normal mug. Like it's no heavier than my coffee mug is a wee bit heavier than this but it's not paper thin either there maybe you can see it that way and the bottom says oh, i'm shaking sorry on the bottom says dang it i don't know starts with a j I don't know what it says. I would think it would say Disney, but it. Hmm. When I look at it, it's backwards. I don't know if I can see it from the inside, but there are words right here. Um, L U M I N. A-R-C is what's on the bottom. Because you have to look mm. through the grass. You have to look through the grass to see it. Oh, good Lord. <laughs> but when you look through here, you can see what it says. I'm happy okay? to know I'm not the only one that says stuff like that. Oh, my gosh. That comes out of my mouth all the time. <laughs> okay. <laughs> if you would like... Mickey, he's six dollars. Okay. Come on. Could give me crop. Got it. Okay. Then I have three of the denim kids. These are Homeco. They're called the Denim Days by Homeco, 1985, Home Interiors Gifts Incorporated. Crafted in Malaysia, M-A-I-A-Y-S-I-A, -A -A, Malaysia. Here he is. 
Because oh, punk, my goodness, with a pumpkin. How about these for fall? Whoops, let me get it over here. Be great. He has no chips. He has no cracks. Reaching down to pick up his pumpkin. And here she is with her pumpkin. Ah, there we go. She has a basket with punk with a that ponytail. Oh, and she has a pink bow. She's so pretty, I do. and mm -hmm. I cannot believe that her hands and her tail is still attached. Like somebody didn't break it off or something. But there are no chips, no cracks. She's in perfect shape. Okay. And then one more denim guy. He's on his way to school. He has his books and his cowboy hat. And he's got a slingshot in his hand. Oh, my goodness. Oh, yeah. Love those. There's, these are all the denim kids. Okay. He stands like this. And, of course, she's bent down. So she's shorter. And where the other one? Oh, it's in my lap. And he's bent down. So the great deal for today, if you take these two who match, if you take these two who match, I'll throw him in. Just, Aww. just so they stay together. So this one would be free. These two together are $12. And I'll throw him in because I don't have her. They had her, but she was all broken up. And I left Aww. her there. So if you like these two are 12, this one is free. Great deal, y'all. What's that? I said that's a great deal. They're so cute for fall. Kids going back to school, it all fits in. And like I said, look at their hands. They have never been broken. Am I echoing? No, you're fine. It's probably me. Oh, okay. And then, how about her? She reminds me, if you ever watch Little House on the Prairie, she reminds me of Nellie Olson. Look at her curls. And if you ever watch Little House on the Prairie, little Nellie Olson was always the one that her parents had all the money and she would shove it in everybody's face. And she just is so mean delicate. <laughs> She's so pretty. And her doll. She has no chips, no cracks. Look at that dress. I still think she reminds me of Nellie Olsen. That's the first thing I thought when I saw her. Nellie Olsen. Okay. She Oops. is also on co. Her number is 1419. She still has her, it wants to lift off, but she still has her home code sticker. And she's $6. If anybody's interested, oh she's $6. Yeah, television, I see I can see that. Television's first mean girl, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Then oh Jane, please be careful. You shouldn't be bending, Jane. Okay. 
here's this beautiful trivet. Isn't this cute? That's amazing. And it also has its um legs. So it'll stick, it'll hang. You could hang him just like that on your wall. Reach up and grab him every time you have a hot dish. He mm -hmm. is adorable. He is. I have one in my I have one in my window. He's real about this big. And he has stained glass in him. So I let the sun grab the stained glass and let it shine through. If you're interested in this trivet, okay, he's $8. Oh, great price. He looks brand new. He looks like he was never used. Mm -hmm. He's dusty, so he looks like he was hanging. Okay, and if y'all don't mind, that's it. <laughs> hey, Sharon. Um, hey, um, Dave here first. I think that ought to be it, darling. I really do. Let me see. Can I put that up here? I think you've done an amazing it? job. Oh, Belinda. Belinda put eight. Okay, thank you. Belinda. Thank you. Jane Jane had an uh, accident with a chandelier and a broke back. <laughs> you want to tell me real quick? Let me put you back up there. I don't know if she can hear me. What's that? What'd you say? Dee's asking you what happened. The, Dee asked you I, what happened. I turned the light on. The light that's attached to the ceiling fan because I have 11 ceiling fans throughout the house because I only heat with wood. So it takes the heat from the wood burner through the house and I reached up, turned the light on and the, it had worked, vibrated itself loose and the light fixture come down and hit me on the head. And when it did that, it broke. I had glass in my hair and I got that all out and went to the doctor. They got the rest of it out, but it kept hurting my neck. It was like my neck locked up and I couldn't move my neck. Like how your knee sometimes locks up. So I went back to the doctor and they did x-rays and it, what it did is it hit jammed up my neck and put too much pressure on three vertebrae in the top of mm -hmm. my back. So now I have to wear a brace. It broke all three of them. Like a See dummy. why we're saying she's our hero? I don't know why she's up here doing this today, except for she's determined. And you're in our prayers, Jane. You are. You're in our prayers. Well, and um, Thank you. Anything weird just, that can happen, I'm telling you, yeah, the that, last that could have been oh, this so much year, worse. Oh, this year has been like just when I think nothing else can happen, I'm on my way. I got everything fixed up. I got everything ready to go for another sale. And don't you know something else happens? It never fails. So that's what happened, but I'm not giving up. I'm going to keep pushing it. Bless your heart. A little bit. Okay. No, I'm sorry it happened to you. Jane's very smart, very determined. I love you, Jane, and you for being so determined. But please, please, please take care of yourself. And everybody that came in today, oh, you just made me feel so special by coming in. I appreciate it. I love you and I hope that you come back on the next Friday that is tomorrow because today we want Friday. The Friday, that's tomorrow. <laughs> and if the Lord says the same, I'll be here. 
And um, Lucid, hopefully, it's just got a little allergies going on, and hopefully she'll feel like coming back. But if not, then we look forward to next week with her. She needs to take a little break and make sure she's well. I went to the doctor and got some medicine. Hopefully, she will. Because my allergies has been really kicking my hiney. And we Ooh. love her and miss her. And any of y'all that has a channel, put it in there. or right, Come back to the comments and put it in. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up and subscribe. And subscribe to all the other channels. And uh, we love you, Dee. Thank you for coming over here. I know you got to go get the half price stuff today. Uh, thank you, Fairy, for putting the hit the like on the way out. Thank you. And I love you. And I'll see you tomorrow if the Lord says the same. Bye-bye. Bye. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Oh, thank you for coming. Thank you.